I just wanted to come on oh. here and tell you guys. About oh, is her boyfriend in the car? Is her boyfriend in a car and does he like to wear nail polish? Look at those knuckles. About the special talent I have. Um, a lot of people think I'm really talentless and I just, Can't get over those knuckles. you know, use that one site where you sell fans um but i'm actually super talented so i yeah, can burp those main hand. hands uh oh god yeah i knew it i knew it'd be something disgusting i, I, I knew it'd be something disgusting. yeah it makes sense she wanted to roll the windows up before she started this disgusting ass behavior this is what you this is what we expect from you this is the reason why we put you in a category of big back, big backs, big back, big, because this is what you, this is big back behavior, man. Burping, she gonna be, she really wanna start doing some farting. She, when she gets off camera, oh, she gonna rip it big. She gonna fart right into the coochie. She gonna fart right into the cooter cooker. She's wearing pants, so, and she's she's a big girl, so it ain't gonna come out the top. That air's gonna go, it's gonna go look, look for some, uh, Something to escape. Anyway, man, you know, she's in here burping in. This is y'all's representation. This is the reason why you have guys that want to feed you McDonald's. They want to, they, these guys have a fetish for seeing you, you know, burp your way, you know what I'm saying, into his heart, you know, burp your way um, all the way home. You know what I mean? This is, no, it's not attractive. Not in the slightest. Uh. <clears throat> What's your special talent? Uh. 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 Are you not impressed? I mean, I think it's pretty impressive. Uh. <laughs> oh, wow. Why don't she take that act on the road? She can burp on command. She is super talented. On top of that, she has a Lonely Fans account. Yep, it's oh, pretty oh. obvious that men are totally the problem here. This gem of a queen who's worth her weight in pork rinds and is obviously a great catch. Listen, ladies, you got to pick a struggle. I mean, if you don't have the best body out there, then have something else. Don't try to substitute. It, it looked like she was bursting on burps. Like, was she swallowing air? I mean, I'm sorry. It's the big back, big back. Was she eating air and then burping it up? In the comment section, you guys let me know. We're currently at timestamp. I don't know, man. Uh, 12 minutes. Was she was was she eating air and then burping it up? It's like she was eating air and then burping. It's weird. To an hourglass figure with, with some kind of burping. I mean, what else is she going to do? Juggle her boogers or something? Don't get me wrong. I'm not body shaming anyone right now. I actually do enjoy seeing women getting good relationships out there. But ladies, you got to put in the work. I mean, this is a classic example of a young Act. lady who's decided not to put in any work. I mean, she obviously doesn't put any work in the gym. It appears that she You know, this is why we have to go overseas, man, because um, if they're outwardly showing us all this disgusting behavior, man, when imagine these poor dudes that are getting in the bedroom. They're, these are the kind of chicks that be farting while you, you know, hitting it from the back. And then just be like, oh, well, if you're a, a real man, you know that, you know, we all fart and that that's just that's just naturally biologic no 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 absolutely not you know you know what i'm saying real ladies man you you can spread them wide open man they're not farting man okay man i forgot to do this man my phone man look let this play you guys i forgot to put the do not disturb on let's go Loans of videos still playing. She hasn't developed an actual skill other than her selling pics and videos of moving her folds around her Lonely Fans account where there's an epidemic of simps there ready to shell out 3 and to see if they can find a mole in a spot she can't see herself. And I honestly believe that there aren't that many men uh, wanting to put a ring on that. Well, maybe a collar and about a gallon of barbecue sauce. But who am I to king shame anybody? I'm just a blockheaded gorilla. The point is, ladies, expectation management is warranted and burping shouldn't be even part of the equation. Move it on.
Something that I don't think people understand about being fat is like the ways in which this shows up in dating. Because I get a lot of comments here from like, you know, incel dude, bro, gym, basement dwelling, whatever. You know the type, trolls, I mean trolls. And they're always like, well, no one would ever have sex with you. No one would ever date you. And that's not quite true. It's more like you're just very aware that your options are limited or that the ways in which you get approached are limited or that like the things that are available to you more readily are limited. And I've been in a relationship for four years, but I still experience a lot of this because you can just feel that like you are not seen as valuable in the dating space. I know people say marketplace and that feels dehumanizing, but like to a point it's true. Like more than anything, what it is, is an awareness that like your stock is low and that a lot of women have a power in having higher stock, I guess, that they can use to, you know, get things for free or get men to do things for them. Like I am aware of that even as somebody who is in a relationship. I am not looking for love. I have love. I am not necessarily looking for any of those other things either. I'm just aware that they're not available to me and that that is one way in which my body does limit me. And I think when you're a smaller fat person, you may be even more aware of this because it seems weird when your size does not exclude you from a lot of other things in life that it would still exclude you from this. Like oh if you can do all these things, like you can fit in airplane seats, you can travel, you can go on amusement park rides and have fun that way. Like if you are not big enough that your size isn't preventing you from doing a lot of things, it can certainly be something that feels like a sticking place. And that has very much been my experience as a small fat person for my whole life. Maybe we better take off. Yeah, right. Okay, let me start off by addressing the elephant in the room. No pun intended. Small fat person. I was trying to figure out if she was talking about a short fat person. Or okay. Yeah, we're, we're going to end on that note because, you know, when when the big bags start breaking down themselves into different categories within the same uh, spectrum. So I guess you guys are just giving yourself a, a spectrum. You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, this is this is wild behavior, man. Well, know that us normal sized people and skinny people they look at you all the same. A smaller fat person, or you know, sad, you all, you're all out of shape. You're all unhealthy. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Hey, you guys, make sure you smash that like button. You know, my son will be getting here any minute. I'm going to see what's going on with Streamlabs. And uh, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Drop a comment. Let me know what you think. You know, am, am I just being, am I wrong? Because the the whole point in a certain level of my shaming is to want to get people motivated and get into the gym. Okay, you can get into the gym. You can lose all of this, you know, whatever. Because if you're a cute uh, big chick, then you're going to probably be a fine fit chick. You know, if you're a cute big chick, you're going to probably be a fine fit chick, you know, or thin chick. So you probably be like real pretty in the face. We want to see that bone structure. We want to see you get healthy and live as long as possible. We're not shaming you in a bad way. It's to keep you healthy. You'll live longer. You'll live more happy. And isn't that what this what this uh, life is about? Just living and living as peacefully and happy as you possibly can. Listen, just trying to give you some good advice. Um, but hey, if you want to stay big, stay big. It's whatever. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, y'all, love and light. I'm your brother and I'm out. In this game, you got to have that dog in you. Made in America. Lost.